Hey everybody, it's Big Papa with Big Papa's Barbecue. Uh, today we're going to be trying out the Tribal Fire Grill on some breakfast for dinner. Uh, one of our favorites around the house is eating breakfast for dinner, eating eggs and bacon and sausage and all the good stuff that you usually eat for breakfast and cooking it on the grill for dinner. Want to show the versatility of the Tribal Fire Grill? Just think about this, if you're sitting around deer camp and you're wanting to cook breakfast or you're wanting to cook supper for a bunch of people, watch what I do on this uh, Tribal Fire and think about that. So all we're going to do today is we're just going to throw everything on. I mean, we can cook it all at once. That's what's so great about it. Hear that sizzle? Bacon on, let it get going. Got some sausage patties. I'm gonna put down just a little bit of oil. Get in. Put a little oil in. And if you got two or three people. Everybody can be running their own station all at once. That's why we like to call it Grilling 360. Because you can have one person working the bacon, one person working the sausage patty, one person working the hash brown. You throw that right on top up here. You still got your grilling area, even when you're using your griddle. You still got your area to grill up there. Start flipping your bacon. This thing's hot, ready to go. It doesn't take long for it to cook. Here's a little tip though, if you're using the tribal fire, and you want something not to cook quite as fast, if you put it out towards the edge out here around the ring, not quite as hot out that way. But this bacon, it don't matter, you get as hot as you want. This will cook up just right. I don't know of any other grill that you can cook a whole breakfast on all at once. That's why I love the travel fire. A lumberjack charcoal, keeping everything good and hot. It is in the middle. Already done. Slide this down to the middle. Notice how nothing's sticking. It's all coming up nice and easy. Little bacon ready to come off. I wish I had one of those rings like they use at the, the Waffle House, but I'm not that high tech of a redneck yet. Sausage done. Patty sausage. Got the link sausage done. We're going to do something a little special. I found this the other day at the store and it caught my attention. It's Johnsonville, made by Johnsonville, but it's chorizo sausage 
that's cut into bacon. And I tried some the other day, and it's very good. But we're gonna put some on the grill tonight. And we're gonna have it for breakfast for dinner. The bacon. We'll those up. Can you imagine everybody out at the deer camp though or coming over for dinner at your house and you're cooking hot dogs or hamburgers or you want to do breakfast or whatever it is and everybody's just hanging out, hanging around the grill. It just gives you an opportunity that not a lot of grills do. That's why I, I keep saying how much I love my tribal fire. We're going to be cooking biscuits on it. We'll do that afterwards. But I'll include it in the video. This chorizo sausage uh, bacon, whatever you want to call it, man, it would be so good in place of regular bacon on a BLT or on your hamburger or wherever you normally use bacon. This, you like a little spice in your life, this is the stuff that is get it done. Now tell me you wouldn't be the king of the cul-de-sac with this sitting at your house, cooking up eggs, bacon, and sausage, hash browns, biscuits, and all that kind of good stuff. Y'all are all sitting out there at deer camp or sitting out in your backyard. You got this cleaned up for the eggs. When you get ready to pour your eggs, like I said, it's all slanted going down this way to make it easy to clean. So when you're pouring your eggs on there, you want to catch them until they get a little stiff. Because if you don't, it'll run off in the middle. So you just kind of catch them. Let them get a little stiff. Now these eggs I'm, I'm doing here, they you see a little stretch to them. It's called uh, cooking for my wife, and she likes cheese in hers, so they got a little bit of cheese in there, so uh, that's why they're a little stringy. Ain't nothing wrong with my eggs. And she also likes them done well. I'm going to do me a little batch for me and my brother and not do them quite as well. That's how you do some eggs for my, my wife. Get them good and dry. My son likes them that way too. There again. You see nothing really stuck on the grill. All coming up nice and easy. What about it over here? Got my hash brown. Now they're brown enough. So those over here are a little bit closer to the middle. those brown up and I got a little bit more egg. You can't remember to catch them. Catch them and let them stiffen up. Kind of pull, pull them back towards the, the edge. And then once they start stiffening up, then you start scrambling. Now we got our breakfast except for the biscuits and I'll show y'all how I cook those up here in a little while. I have my Weber kettle lid that I'm using as a dome. Nice and hot. Got my pan of homemade, show enough homemade biscuits. I'm gonna put them on there. Put my lid back on. Got my vent all the way open. We're gonna let them sit there and cook on the tribal fire grill. How many grills can you cook biscuits on your grill with? All right, it's been about 20 minutes for our biscuits. I'm gonna pull the top, and take a look at them. Huh, they don't look bad. They're not quite as brown as I would like them on the top. But for on a grill, 
they look pretty doggone good. Hey everybody, thank you for joining me today with the Tribal Fire Grill, my lumberjack lump charcoal. Um, one of my favorite things, and I hope it's everybody else's that was here's favorite thing, is breakfast for dinner. Just want to show you the versatility of the Tribal Fire Grill. It's a great grill to have out in your backyard, to have a bunch of company over. You can cook all kinds of stuff, hamburgers, hot dogs, french fries. You can fry on it. You can do all kinds of stuff. Take it to the deer camp when you get ready to go to deer camp. Everybody can be cooking their stuff all at the same time, fixed for the whole camp all at one time on one grill. If you haven't checked it out, go online at www.tribalfiregrill.com. Take a look at it. If you decide you want one, Get ready to enter the code at the end, put in Big Papa. That's Big Papa, P-A-P-A. -P -A. You get your discount, and you'll get you a great grill. Thanks, everybody, for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a blessed day.